Eva here with Eva LaVey Arts and today I've got a quick video for you on how to create an envelope for your deconstructed art journal pages. I'm going to start with a pink piece of 12 by 12 pattern paper since we are celebrating Breast Cancer Awareness Month and I'm going to cut it down to nine and three quarters by nine and three quarters. Next we'll be using the 123 punch board. This is one that I got from Stampin' Up! And you'll want to line it up to three and a half inches on the left side and then give it a punch and use the little tool there to score your line. As far as it will go, it won't go all the way to the edge, but we'll correct that on the other side. Then you'll flip it over and Lined it up to three and a half inches again and do your punch and score your line as far as it will go. And then we'll turn that so that the two little notches are on your right and you're really just going to line up the punch and then score the line. So you'll be able to see where that little notch is and just fit it in to where the little punch would go. Then we'll flip it over and do the other side at three and a half as well. Punch and score. And now this is going to uh, follow the line that was already there. And then flip at three and a half. Punch and score the other side of that line that was already there. It's okay that they don't, um, that the scoring line is one way and another way on the other side, if you know what I mean. Um, and then you'll flip it and do the short side, score that short side as well. Just lining it up like we did before. And there you have the pattern that we can now just fold in those short sides and build up the top bottom and then what I do is use a pencil to mark where I want to cut it I don't really like have you don't have to do this but I just don't like having that little flap up there so I just line it up on my paper cutter and cut that little edge off and then I'll take my Mono adhesive, or you can use any kind of Elmer's glue. Or any adhesive you have that's permanent. And put a line there to close up the envelope. want to take off that little edge and so I'm just using a corner rounder and there you have it this envelope will fit your 4x8 deconstructed art journal pages perfectly I'll show you one here this is one I did recently for uh, playing cards with some uh, Stencils that I had pre cut or myself hand cut and fits in there just like that. Pretty easy. A great way to make use of all that pattern paper that you've got. And if you'll just give me a thumbs up if you like this video and don't forget to subscribe. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comments. See you again.